Hi everyone. As an attorney representing quite a few victims suffering from cancer and respiratory issues caused by the recalled Philips CPAP machines, I hear that so many of you are still waiting for a replacement machine despite registering on the Philips website months ago. The problem is, what do you do about your sleep apnea while you're still waiting? Should you just remove the foam and continue using your recalled machine? Well, according to the FDA website just updated September 10th, the answer is no. The FDA specifically recommends you do not attempt to remove the sound abatement foam as it may impact device performance and possibly introduce additional foam debris into the device air pathways. Making matters worse, it doesn't seem like Philips has any system to prioritize the replacement of the defective machines to veterans, those with extreme risk of heart attack, or anyone else. I hope you never need me because you suffered from cancer or any other side effects from these defective CPAP machines. But if you do, call me anytime.